I'm here at Red Hat Summit with Sherard on my right and Kyle on my left. And you guys just led a lab around analytics and machine learning. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, absolutely. What we realized at Red Hat and the AI Center of Excellence is that uh, analytics and AI, they really are transformational and they transform the business of our customers. In order to do that, we realize that there's two key components to that. One is intelligent applications and making sure that developers are enabled and empowered to create intelligent applications. But the other side of that, which is equally and maybe even more important, is the infrastructure. And in this lab, we focused on how do we enable developers and engineers to improve their infrastructure for AI workloads. And that's where, where Kyle and his team have been and doing excellent work in the storage part. And so what, what kind of infrastructure is involved in the uh, storage components for this? Well, I mean, if you look at the, like if you look at the Google's Borg paper, they talk about how the, even their storage services are running inside of the, the orchestration framework. And I think, the, I think the future is for people to run their storage infrastructure completely inside of OpenShift 2. So in this particular lab, we're making use of the, the operator framework in OpenShift 4 to, and the Rook operator to deploy uh, a Ceph distributed object store um, that's uh, uh, you know with multiple gateways that are scaled behind uh, Kubernetes uh, services, and then we're using that to uh, perform analytics directly on the object store in situ, and then use it as a, a source for for data to train machine learning models, but then also to store the resulting models, and then deploying apps uh, like a, a serving app for those models. Um, and the, the model is actually in the object store itself, so it's not on a, it's not like locally baked into the image, or it's not on like a RWX volume that's, that's shared across it. It's everything is kind of object store native, and it's uh, very scalable, and which is important when you're dealing with these sorts of volumes of data. All right, so how how do we leverage that infrastructure with uh, with software? Absolutely. One of the things we've done in the AS and of Excellence is we lead up a project called the Open Data Hub. And that allows developers to be able to grab a reference architecture that we've been using internally at Red Hat that includes things like the object store, Ceph with the data lake, and some of the other tools, but all running in OpenShift and, and all containerized. So it's a quick, easy way to get up and running. And then also we have a lot of people, both in the storage BU as well as in the AI Center of Excellence, that'll, allow, that'll help shepherd customers along that whole process of enabling their entire infrastructure and enabling their people to be able to do those types of workloads. There's a lot of material out there uh, not only this workshop, but also continuing to have uh, educational material for our customers to showcase how these workloads are possible. All right. Well, I look forward to people checking that out. Thanks.